In the Gospel of Luke, chapter 9, you have that amazing miracle of Jesus feeding the 5,000. And then right after that, Jesus asks his men an amazing question. He says, who do the crowds say that I am? And they responded like this. Some say you're John the Baptist, because Jesus did go around preaching repentance. He said, some say you're Elijah, because Jesus did all kinds of miracles. Some say you're one of the prophets, because Jesus talked about the future. He prophesied about things that were to come. And so Jesus looked at them and said, but who do you say that I am? And that's the question for every single person that God comes and knocks on their door and calls him to himself. Who do you say Jesus is? Peter spoke up and he said that you are the Christ of God. You're the Messiah. You're the Savior. And Jesus would go on to say to them, and listen to what he says, if anyone comes after me, let him deny himself, take up his cross daily, and follow me. For whoever desires to save his life will lose it. Whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. And then he says this most powerful thing. This is an amazing statement Jesus makes. What would it profit a man if he gained the whole world and to lose his own soul? For whoever is ashamed of me and my words, of him the Son of Man will be ashamed when he comes in his glory and his Father and his holy angels. So Jesus asked the question, who do you say that I am? And if you believe that he's the Christ, the Messiah, the Son of God, then he says, okay, prove it. Take up your cross daily, follow me, and don't be ashamed of me. That's the call, that's who he is, that's what we're all about. Follow him daily and not being ashamed of the fact that he's the Christ, the Son of God.